Hi everyone, I'm Jason Jurtich and this is The Mobile Philosopher. In this tutorial, we're going to see how to copy one sheet to multiple spreadsheets using a Google script. The only thing we have to do to start off is to make sure that the spreadsheet that has a sheet we want to copy is in the same folder as the rest of the spreadsheets we're going to copy the sheet to. After we're done with that, we're going to go into this first spreadsheet that's going to have the sheet that will be copied, and we're going to open that up. So we'll pass to that one then. This is the spreadsheet we're going to use that's going to be copying. Down here, we've already renamed it to Sheet Copy to indicate that it was copying. And then we're going to go to Tools, Script Editor. When we get into Script Editor, the first thing we're going to do is change the title to something else. Then we're going to make this just slightly bigger so that you guys can see it better. We're going to paste the script that we've copied previously from somewhere else. I will actually share the script publicly in a document in a link below the video. Here, as you can see, there's three parts to this script. We have the first part, which is the adding the menu or the button that will allow us from the spreadsheet to run the script, even though we're not in the script. As you can see, it says add menu here. The second part is actually to find the spreadsheet and the sheet we're going to copy, as well as the rest of the files that all should be in the same folder. And this is what this section does here. And down below, right after this where it says while, this is actually the command that says to copy, meaning if there are files in this folder that have not had this sh new sheet, if they have not received it, then you're going to copy it to those spreadsheets. And down below the last part here is just simply to set the name or change the name of that sheet we're going to copy. So the only two things you need to change in this script is going to be this number here, which is basically symbolizing the number of the sheet inside the spreadsheet. Meaning if it's the first spreadsheet, it's gonna be number zero. If it's the second spreadsheet, you're gonna put a number one, third, two, et cetera, et cetera. And down here, we're just going to change this name here to sheet copied. Just so that we have something to indicate, which is actually the name we already gave. So once we have this done, the only thing, again, that you're gonna have to do is just change that number if you have to, and this name here. The rest of it is simply exactly the same. You don't have to do anything else to it. After we're done with that, we're going to save it by this button here. We're going to let it save, and then we're going to go up here and we're going to select the first function so that it can run the rest. So we're going to do on open, and then we're going to click run here. After we finish with this, the only thing we have to do is to go back to the other spreadsheet, the original one that we're using. And as you can see, it is now added an option up here to run the script. We're going to press on copy to spreadsheet, and then we're going to click on paste sheet. Once we're done with that, it's going to say running the script. It says it's finished. And now we can actually prove that it's actually done its work because if we go to the test documents that were in that same folder, we go over to them, we're going to see in this test three that indeed the sheet copied has been copied here. If we go to the next one, we're going to see that indeed in the same way, test number two also has the sheet copied. So as you can see, the script has indeed worked and this will be the same also in test one. So as you can see, it has been, it has done its job in copying this sheet to the rest of them. If you have any questions in regards to this, please leave them below in the comments. Feel free to use any of this information as you want with any type of institution that you desire. And if there's anything you need, please let me know as well in the comments. I hope this serves you. Thank you very much. Take care.